key price levels to look out for for Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin and Ripple. Welcome back guys, it's CryptoRocko here and in today's video I'll talk about key resistances and supports and potential places we could look to buy. So without further ado guys let's get into the video so all my eyes are on Bitcoin guys to see what Bitcoin is doing we've been talking about this triangle or this kind of wedge or this this bull flag that's happening and and we're looking for it to break out so it has seen some good bull volume and it, it pushed up I would have liked a bit more bull, uh, bit more volume but it is looking good my indicators are looking good so what I am looking for is for this touch uh, of this break of the trend line to hold again I haven't drawn this perfectly and um, touch of this trend line to hold and then for it to move up so th this is this could be a potential buy so if it breaks above you could put an order above there and see if it breaks up and then at the minimum if it does break out you could target around that level initially and again it's not the best trade because you if it breaks out I'd expect it to go higher but that's a potential trade that you could take and um, there was some potential to buy at this levels and um, to see like, kind of the double bottom I wouldn't I wouldn't take that take necessarily but let's see how it plays out because if it does break out I would expect it to um, go higher potentially uh, test the re test the highs so that's what I'm looking at for Bitcoin guys it all depends on Bitcoin yeah, that that was a bit for next charts so, this chart is similar to for other exchanges as well this is what I'm looking out for coinbase guys those are the key resistance zone that I'm looking out for so you buy around here try and sell around over there or you could wait and um, try to get decent uh, risk to reward um, if you if you buy here but it's not as good if you had bought uh, at the at the resistance so that's what I'm looking out for uh, Bitcoin guys Ethereum is slightly different Ethereum did break out of it Ethereum moved up a lot higher than other cryptocurrencies so it, we're seeing a bit more of a pullback but it is holding support at the um, hourly hourly 200 or the uh, the 4 hourly 50 so that's where we're seeing support um, I did look at uh, so I did sell some around here because it was looking a lot toppy the RSI divergence was there so it was forming higher highs and it was forming higher lows and as you can see it was a decent uh, decent trade guys and I, I got out around uh, the 200 moving average so that's what I'm looking up for ethereum ethereum again it's not looking great because if you were looking at this market and not as a, as a crypto market expecting it to go higher you'd expect it to retest this and potentially maybe go down because it is a key level that is broken out of but it has got some support like you say it's the moving averages and if it holds we get some bull volume it could go higher but I'm not looking to trade uh, well I'm not looking to trade Bitcoin or Ethereum at the moment I am in a position of Litecoin and and some Bitcoin um, but only my Litecoin position is is slightly significant um, XRP guys so this is the XRP hasn't even broken out of this trend line so we expect we're hoping XRP can break out this could be the fake breakout and if it breaks out now we could see really good action for XRP one thing to note of I made in my previous video is XRP hasn't really broken out so the, we haven't seen massive bull moves from XRP so if it does break out we could see some bull action because Bitcoin broke out Ethereum broke out Litecoin broke out XRP hasn't had that so XRP could potentially break out higher that's what I'm looking up for XRP guys Litecoin the, the coin that I'm trading the most um, sorry uh, I've got my uh, price levels drawn out on my other um, on my other trading view account but what I what I am looking at is for this double top this needs to break if this breaks again it's it's doing well because it hasn't pulled back that much it's pull, pulled back to three six a uh, two three six level and if it can break above it that's what we want to see but there are some key levels that we're looking out for the key things we're looking out for there is a RSI divergence that doesn't necessarily mean that it won't go higher but it's a it's a good indicator to what we can be expecting and um, it could maybe have another leg higher and an RSI could pull back so it doesn't necessarily mean that it, when, when it's in a strong trend there could be divergence and it could or it could be overbought and it could keep going higher and higher that's the level that I bought I um, met all my kind of targets and that's where I'll have my probably stop loss if you do try and get the break make sure your stop loss is below there and um, it should hold that level if if a Litecoin is to stay in a bull trend but 
Litecoin is looking good guys it's broken into new highs uh, and the resistance for Litecoin will come around this level so it has got some resistance but the key resistance will be over there but if, if Litecoin can break above the double top guys you'd expect it to hit around this level maybe face some resistance but I'm expecting Litecoin around that level compared to the video that I made I'm still sticking to what my prediction is but if it does break below guys and, and can't it's like a fake uh, head and shoulder breakout then I might be wrong uh, but again um, I've locked in so I've locked in really good profits and I'm still in some trade and if it comes back and even retest and move higher I could look to buy but I would get out and then buy more later so that's what I'm looking at for uh, the four key coins guys I hope you enjoyed this video just a quick update and make sure you do not buy uh, the support or buy the resistance and sell the support that's the number one rule so that's why I want to tell you guys what the key levels are so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much